This video is brought to you in part by True Tech Tools, quality tools, essential support. All right, so it's going to be pretty noisy in here, so <clears throat> you may not be able to hear a whole lot. What we're doing is uh, they have a valve that they found to be bad, and we need to change it. It's on a uh, little air compressor here. So each one of these are air compressors. You can see the piston up here at top. And obviously, you compress something that gets really hot. That's the motor there. What we need to do is change the pressure control valve on this uh, cooler unit. So you've got glycol coming through here, goes to the head pressure control. That's going to open and close based off the discharge pressure, which you can see right here. So it's going to go to there. Then you got your blow down valves and stuff, so if it gets too much water in there, it blows it out. There's your compressor, coaxial coil. That's what we're doing today uh, for the first call. It cools the glycol that is going to cool the machine or a separator to help get the moisture out of it. So first we're gonna get in here and see if we can uh, isolate this thing. We're gonna have to break it loose here and there should be a simple change. Boy, somebody over tightened that. Holy crap. A little short sucker, but made out of metal.